Compactor Farming Simulator. And today, I'm going to have a look at silo compaction. So, if you've done a lot of silage, then obviously, you know, compacting it can be quite time consuming. So, we've got a, a pit here that I've pre set up. I've got about 400,000 litres of chaff in. It is 11% compacted. That's just the result of me getting it all in here and getting it somewhat level. Um, and I'm going to test a bunch of pieces of kit. So we have two base game ones. Um, so kind of a pretty standard budget roller. The Dusseldorf 3000. Um, we've got one that I use a lot. The DSC Weber. The Weber DSC 180. Um, we've got from the tractor pulling pack. This guy. So this is available on all platforms and then at the end here we have this one which is a pc only mod which we'll look at separately uh yeah so the plan is i'm going to test each one of these uh on the same tractor so we've got a nice deutz 8280 here one of my favorite tractors um i'm gonna test this test all th test the first three um, on this tractor. Each time I will reset back to the same point. So we'll be starting with the same 11% compacted silage clamp. I'm going to run them for five minutes or until they are complete. Whichever is the soonest of those. Um, and so I'm going to jump out to some pre-recorded footage. I have pre-recorded this bit. Um, we'll have a look at how they behave and then we'll come back and have a look at the last one. So I've done these as a time lapse because no one wants to watch 15 minutes of silage compaction. So it's running at five times speed pretty much. Um, this one is kind of the cheapest, most basic one. Probably the sort of thing that's used quite a lot in the real world. Um, you know, it's a bit like Tom Pemberton, the ones that they get folks in with, um, you know, sort of railway train wheels on a metal frame kind of thing. It's heavy, it compacts. So, you know, it, it, it's gonna do a job for you. It's probably what I think you would most commonly use a lot of the time anyway. I, I tend, uh, I don't really see many people using the Weber one that often, um, which we will come on to next, which is um, kind of spoiler alert, the best base game one um, by quite a long way and is very similar to most of the modded ones. So just coming up on the five minutes and we are 30% compacted with the normal one. Now we've got the Weber on and we're going to go through the same process. So we'll do five minutes or until it's 100% compacted. And uh, yeah, I, I don't see many people using this one, I don't think. Quite often, if I've got a big silage clamp to compact, because the, the nice thing about this, I guess the nice, you could probably do it with most of them, but I find this one works quite well when you put one on the front and one on the back. And there's no reason why you couldn't do that with the standard roller, I guess. Um, but yeah, I, I quite like this one. I use it a lot. It is very effective. It's and it's also um, there are things like the the uh, the Holorus one, the uh, the modded one that's available on Mod Hub that has a similar compaction scale to this. So I do know that I could just go in and look at the numbers in the XML and tell you the answers. But some people like a visual, and I do know I could just go in and edit them and make them however I want, but not everyone can do that. So we're showing what's available. So 50% compacted for that one. Uh, so much better than the normal one. And then we have this one. This is from the tractor pulling pack. And as you can see, within uh, 40 seconds, it's done. So, yep. So yeah, just run through those three. Clearly the one from the tractor pulling pack is significantly better than the others. And that is available on all platforms. So if I just jump in here, um, so you'll see this is the, the, the first one we tested. It's 8,000 um, pounds. The Weber is 12 and a half. So it's not actually that much more expensive. 
Um, we'll ignore those. And then we have this one, the, uh, the Stego 485 Pro Wheeled, which is from the tractor pulling pack. And I'll put links for these down below. This one is available on all platforms. So you guys on console can use this one. All right. And then there's these, there are these three. So these are on King Mods and these are an edit of the base game one. Um, but as you can see, they have significantly more compaction. So the one I have out here is the 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 most insane one. And we're just going to demonstrate that very quickly. So um, compared to I, I haven't actually looked at the compaction numbers in the XML. I just know it's a really big number. So if we just back up here getting the clamp so you'll see we're at 11 percent compaction ready 100 percent compaction job done if you don't want to actually compact your silage then that's the one for you but um obviously it's up to you how you play your game i i really like the weber um I may, on some situations, start using the one from the tractor pulling pack because that's quite nice as well. Just drop that off the back of the tractor. So, yeah, there you go. There are some options for different speeds of silo compaction. If you found this video useful, then please click the like button. Any comments, questions, suggestions telling me what I've done wrong and why I'm stupid, stick those below. Uh, I say thank you to the YouTube channel members and patrons. Appreciate you guys all supporting the channel. And I will see you next time on Farming Simulator.